I'm not going to let this go. I've been afraid to make a video. No, I haven't. I've been listening. And I don't know what can be said. I think that every person that makes videos on YouTube should have ad revenue coming in. That's something I realized. There are no elites. Even if you're getting $20 every three months because you have 150 views or 300 views, you should be getting paid for the time that you put in to this new way of being digitally online. Everybody is helping by just by being. It's the people with the out-of-control egos that need to be humiliated, including myself. Humiliation, humility is incredibly important. Humility is bringing the ego down, and when I have friends, I will humiliate them. It sounds harsh. It's not humiliation like, you fucking idiot. It's just bringing the ego down by calling them out, by pointing out where there's no truth. That's what friends do is they keep their, each other's egos in check. If I see a friend suffering, then I bring their ego up. And if I see a person with an overly inflated ego, I bring it down. I offer that. Honesty is the most important thing. Now, Terry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that how it came out, I'm not... I don't think that you're acting like a 15-year-old, like Lisa and Kevin and you and whatever the, his name is, Dax, whatever n n your name is, I don't know. Terry, you, you don't act like that. The character of Zipster is a mask for the truth. And I don't know if a mask is a bad idea. I know you're not getting on and telling jokes. You're not getting on and fucking around. You're getting on and, and speaking about yourself and your what you feel and what you think and you're using that because it makes it easier for you I know that I don't I definitely don't think it's necessary at all I think it's a choice anytime we put on a, a, a show we're choosing to do that people seem to, to, to be more comfortable with it because they don't have to face themselves when they see a show. They can just watch the show. But when it's a person being themselves, then you start to realize what you are. And that's unsettling sometimes. And that's why humanity is so fucked. Because people don't want to look at themselves. Because it's hard. Well, I think that we should look at ourselves and be paid for it. Something. I'm not saying we should. It should pay our all our bills, but I don't like that they separate and give these certain people money, and then it makes other people want to be like the people that are getting money or or what it seems like. So people just act out and they do the craziest shit in order to get some people's attention, in the hopes that they're going to make some money. And I don't want that YouTube to become that. It's too great of a of a technology to fucking blow it on people screaming and acting wild and trying to make make exer make jokes and, and release tension. Why don't we focus God damn this is a hard fucking thing to do. Terry, I think of you as you you are you have become one of my best friends. You are. I, we, we're going through this same experience and talking to you about it, it helps me. And calling your name out like that, yeah, it was an ego deflation. I know I don't have people like, what do you fuck right do you have to do something like that? I'm just, I'm just doing, I'm just saying what I see. There's a lot of fucking people that could stand to have their ego deflated. 
I can stand to have my ego deflated. And though people will fucking do it. People do it all the time. And that's great. I need that. That's why I have friends. Is so I don't get out of control and start to think I'm the center of the great Ian. I don't say my fucking name. I don't say my name in my... That's one thing, Kevin, that you do that bothers the fuck out of me is that you constantly say the word Nults. Nults, Nults, Nults. I see mom of Nults, sister of Nults, wife of Nults. Nults, Nults, Nults merchandise. Like, dude, that is pure ego inflation. You're using the name, your own name, to make money. Who the fuck do you think you are? Really, besides Kevin Nault or Nults. Come on, man. There's more. Dax Flame, Lisa Nova. What I, that interview that I saw was fucking ridiculous. That's what I and initially had set me off. But I saw this movie Sicko, and I see these people suffering. And then I get on YouTube and I watch two people fucking around in an interview that has hundreds of thousands of views. It's drawing the focus of people away from what can save humanity. I'm so sick of people telling me, lighten up, have a laugh. Come on, life's, don't take life so seriously, have a beer. You know what? No, I'm not going to have a beer. I'm not going to fucking forget about it. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to focus on helping things. I'm going, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. It's fucking painful because it means that people that I think of as friends, that are my friends, I have to be honest with people and doing it publicly is fucking harsh. Doing this on YouTube has been fucking harsh. This whole experience is fucking harsh. But I'm not going to stop because I really want to help. God, I know. Letting people joke around seems like maybe the right thing to do sometimes, but... And I am, I'm still... I can't stop people from joking around. I have no intention of doing that. I want to see more Zipster. I want to see more Kevin Oates. I want to see the evolution of these people. I want to see what happens, but I want also to affect the things. I'm not going to sit by like a bystander <coughs> while I watch people spin themselves into the fucking ground. Dude, Kevin... You have that funny movie of your wife freaking out that you're spending too much time on YouTube. And it's real funny, dude, because you have been. Because your ego has been blown out of proportion. So, yeah, dude, don't let this take over. Don't let this take you over. I, I won't let it take me over. And there's better things we can do with it. I watched videos of people, like, really questioning and talking about it. Like, I, I have 70... I don't have. There are 75, 76 video responses right now of brilliance for the most part, of people really giving reality. I'm watching videos. Esther did this video about the fucking healthcare system. That's 1,200 comments. Like, people are paying attention and waking up now. Maybe I, maybe I had to be explosive and, and volatile and say some really harsh things. Maybe. But if it's waking people up, then I'm doing what I want to do. I'm doing my job. I'm doing something. I'm lending my voice. This video has gone on so long. And I know it's not palatable if it's over five minutes. Right? Well, this is palatable. People are paying attention to this. People are listening to this. And people are talking. People are waking up. But there's more. There's a balance. I'm not crazy. And I'm not trying to hurt people. The truth is painful. It's painful for me. It's not easy to fucking do this. So, I'm going to take it easy, but I'm not going to stop. I just, I don't know what I'm going to do. I just, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. We'll talk again.